In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. Hello, I'm Father Paul, and this is the good news. Christ is in our midst. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight. O Lord, my strength and my Redeemer. Our reading from the Holy Gospel. According to St. Luke, chapter 10, verses 25 through to 37. And behold, a certain lawyer stood up and tested him, saying, Teacher, what shall I do to inherit eternal life? He said to him, What is written in the law? What is your reading of it? So he answered and said, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength, and with all your mind, and your neighbour as yourself. And he said to him, You have answered rightly. Do this, and you will live. But he, wanting to justify himself, said to Jesus, And who is my neighbour? Then Jesus answered and said, a certain man went down from Jerusalem to Jericho and fell among thieves, who stripped him of his clothing, wounded him, and departed, leaving him half dead. Now by chance a certain priest came down that road, and when he saw him, he passed by on the other side. Likewise a Levite, when he arrived at the place, came and looked and passed by, on the other side. But a certain Samaritan, as he journeyed, came where he was, and when he saw him, he had compassion. So he went to him and bandaged his wounds, pouring on oil and wine, and he set him on his own animal, brought him to an inn, and took care of him. On the next day he departed, when he departed, took he took out two denarii and gave him to the innkeeper and said to him, Take care of him, and whatever more you spend, when I come again, I will repay you. So which of these three do you think was neighbour to him who fell among the thieves? And he said, He who showed him mercy on him. And Jesus said to him, Go and do likewise. Glory to you, O God. Come, Holy Spirit, fill our hearts with your love. Help us in the understanding of your words and teachings. Help us to be true and faithful followers of yours. Many of you would have heard this parable before about the Good Samaritan. Yes. In the answer to the lawyer's question, who is my neighbour? He told the parable. But before that, this young lawyer said Teacher, what shall I do to inherit eternal life? He said to him, What is written in the law? What is your reading of it? So he answered and said, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength, with all your mind, and your neighbour as yourself. Jesus was quoting the commandments of God and including loving your neighbour as yourself. Yes. And Jesus said to the young man, You have rightly answered. Do this and you will live. Follow the commandments of God and you will live. 
But I guess to a point he was being a bit smart and he said, And who is my neighbour? And of course Jesus then told the parable of the Good Samaritan. How all these different people ignored the poor man who had been who had been beaten and left on the side of the road half dead. People who you think would take care of this poor wretch. And the one who did was, I guess you could say, a bit of an outcast among the Jews, Samaritans, who looked down upon. But he had compassion on this poor wretch and took care of him. Bandaged his wounds, put him on his animal and took him to the closest inn and took care of him. And then the next day when he had to depart, he gave the innkeeper two denarii. And then he said to the innkeeper, whatever I you pay, do to him and spend on this poor man, when I return, I will repay you. Of course, that last, very last verse, Jesus asked them, of the three, who do you think was the neighbour to him who fell among the thieves? And the answer was, he who showed mercy on him. And then Jesus said to him, go and do likewise. Jesus is telling us to do exactly, to go and do likewise. No matter who the person or is, friend or foe, as a true follower of Christ, we need to do likewise, love our neighbour as ourselves. I urge you all, I urge you all to follow Christ this way. Obey the commandments, and in particular, love your neighbour as yourself. Remember, this is how Jesus was to all. He loved all. Yes. Pray to the Holy Spirit for an understanding, and give him thanks for this. And give him the glory every day. Glory to God for all things. And may the blessing of Almighty God, Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit be upon you and remain with you always. Amen. 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 Most Holy Theotokos, save us. Amen.